We are back in Alaska and back to doing one of our favorite things that we did last time in Anchorage and that was to rip from Pablo's bike rentals and go on the trail. Heading down the trail, or heading down to the trail rather. We start out at Tony Knoll's Coastal Trail. At just under 20 miles round trip and with very little grade, the Tony Knowles Coastal Trail is a wonderful place to get out for a bike ride and to enjoy the wildlife while you're at it. I'm at point one four miles looking out over these coastal mud flats. There's a bunch of geese out there. And a Half mile in. We're at our second tunnel in. We're about to go through this really pretty park which has wetlands. One and a half miles. Still going through that really pretty part with the wetlands. Some beautiful like viewing docks to do bird watching. We're coming up on tunnel number three. Crossing a bridge, looking out over the field to see if there's any moose. See any? I'm hoping to see a moose. Last time we saw several, one almost ran me over walking down the bicycle trail like it was a pedestrian. About two miles in, just under two miles actually. This coastal trail is just so pretty, and almost all of it you can see just right here on the edge of the coast and you can also probably tell that it's a mud flat you don't want to go out there not a beach going through some really pretty forest here it's very wet there's a lot of little pockets of water the trees are really pretty and everything's so green oh three and a quarter miles in heading up a hill through the forest 3.4 miles in, we're seeing some really beautiful little ash trees along the side with red berries. Just a really pretty ride. We're going to work our way. We're away from the coast, but not too far. I can see it through the trees. We're kind of up by a road, but what we're doing is we're wending our way up this bluff. And at the top of the bluff is where air traffic comes in. So I'll try to get some footage of a jet coming in over the trail. It's pretty dramatic. Four miles in from Anchorage on the coastal trail, 
there is a really neat park, which is also an earthquake memorial. The earthquake memorial is for the uh, March 27th, 1964 earthquake, which was a magnitude 9.2 earthquake. And there's a lot of really neat informational signs about the destruction that that did and um, the different geological effects that that had on the area. Four and a half miles. And we've just come up to the edge of the airport. I'm gonna pause in a minute and I'm gonna get some aircraft footage. Should be pretty sweet. Point seven one miles. It's like quite a steep hill. There's a little drop off back there. So you want to make sure your brakes are good when you do that part. But we're going through a really beautiful forest. Last time we did this trail, it was last June. Oh, here's a here's a little pullout. And we saw I think it was six or seven moose on this trail. Today we're not sure if we'll see any hard to see under the clouds but you can just make out like the base of a bunch of huge mountains here and they're just so grand in Alaska because you're going right from the sea and looking like straight up these peaks there's like nothing in between gorgeous countryside just still winding along this bluff Dave just went off rogue mr. honey badger is on a dirt road to my left through the brush we find moose and he came back to get me we'll see if this bike can handle being on the gravel and maybe i'll get some decent footage up here we'll see well i may be taking my life into my hands for this video i just jogged off the trail dave says there could be moose on this road to the right oh there are i'm going to not get very close we've got a big big bull moose here and a cow. I'm going to see if I can zoom in with my other camera. dirt road jog off the trail was maybe quarter mile off the trail with that. We're at 8.4 miles right now. And I think our turnaround is just shy of 10 miles if I remember correctly. I'm not sure. So if you feel like a hike, a very short hike at 9.5 miles, um, here's the map. This is over here. Shows what the little bay that you're on. You can go down the Kincaid Beach Access Trail. We did this last time. And it was a really pretty beach, a uh, little rocky beach you can actually get out on um, and look around, see a pretty view of the mountains and the water um, rather than being a mud flat, which is pretty nice. people stopped on the side of the trail definitely look and see what they're looking at there he goes. we have about three miles to go to where we started again but this is where you get the really great view of Anchorage as you come around the mud flats here all right that was fun 19.5 miles round trip a little over 400 feet of elevation gain and uh i didn't do the last i think there's another half mile of the trail but we saw the coast we saw the moose and uh had a fantastic time so highly recommend this trail and i uh, really love that pablo's bike rental place too